Like Wisconsin faced a shortage of mental health and behavioral health providers. And the problem was worse for kids. Children's Wisconsin has pledged to improve access to therapists, all while facing a therapist shortage. Mary Jo Ola reports new at 10. Sometimes the commitment and sacrifice to become a licensed therapist is a barrier that pushes aspiring professionals away. Children's Wisconsin launched a fellowship that eases that challenge while reaching the growing number of kids that need help. For Jessica Katsakis, becoming a licensed therapist was unrealistic given the necessary demands. Typically, after college, clinicians need 3,000 hours of training to get licensed. Often, those hours are unpaid. As a full-time individual who had a family at home to support, it's not a reasonable option to pursue those hours, nights and weekends in an unpaid setting. Talking to us virtually due to COVID protocols, Jessica says when she heard about the Children's Wisconsin Therapist Fellowship Program, she jumped at the chance. All the things that come together at once to make things a reality. Children's Wisconsin uses donations to pay supervised trainees a salary and offer benefits while they serve kids and families. It helps them get their hours faster and adds to the workforce. Jessica says it has made all the difference in her career path and pursuing her passion to help families. I know that I have an adjective. It's incredible. It's amazing. It's wonderful. It's enlightening. It's hopeful. Since it started two and a half years ago, Children's Wisconsin says eight therapists have successfully completed the program. Right now, 15 are enrolled. Absolutely. I, I believe we've made a huge difference. According to the state, in 2019, Wisconsin had an average of 490 people served by one mental health provider in a county. Nationally, the top state has a ratio of 290 to 1. During the course of our uh, program, we've been able to help over 1,250 families, and we've provided over 15,000 therapy sessions for families that would not have been there before. Mindy Stablejack says it's helped her eight-year-old daughter, Mariska, who started struggling with worsening anxiety over the summer. Like many parents, she found long wait times for mental health resources. Mindy says the fellowship program helped cut the time tremendously. And when Mariska started seeing Jessica for help, mom noticed the difference. She's doing awesome. She's so much more confident. Um, she still does. Jesse did a lot of like breathing techniques with her. Um, affirmations is probably my favorite one. Like talking about how great you are um, to yourself because you are that great. Children's Wisconsin says the ultimate goal with this fellowship is to support and train at least 35 therapists by 2024. Mary Joe Ola, TMJ4 News.